We got to work with our kids and ourselves every day of the week. Doesn't matter the day. What day is it, y'all? What day is it? Saturday. That's right. Even though it's Saturday, you still got to hustle, grind, grow. So I'm over here. My son, he's just learning how to read. So um, he doesn't know his long vowel sounds. So what letter is that? All right. You see how you said A? Whenever, whenever somebody tells you to give me the long vowel sound of the letter A, you just say A. <laughs> you understand? So what letter is this? And the long vowel sound of A is A. Good job. Good job. All right. What letter is that? All right. The long E sound is just E again. So what's the long E sound? So then do you know the long sound of that? What is it? And what's that one? And what's that one? Great job, man. All right. So I'm going to have him uh, write his letters and practice his vowel sounds. Everybody else is about to read. And then we're going to work on reading comprehension. What they're going to be learning about today is Stokely Carmichael, the guy who uh, coined the term Black Power and later changed his name to Kwame Ture. Uh, he spoke a lot out against capitalism. All right. Now, capitalism. Anybody remember? No. Here, let me take this. Hey, do you remember what capital is? Capital? Anything you... Anything you do to own, get... Oh, anything you own to get... That bring... That brings you money? Yes. Anything. Like, give, give me an example. What, what is some... Stocks. What are stocks, Rodney? Stocks are pieces of a company. That have... That have value. That have value. Good job. All right. So, the bad thing about capital is you only tend to get wealth if you own what, Milan? Which is, which is, capital. which is capital. That's right. That's right. So if you don't have capital, you're probably going to end up what, y'all? Broke. Broke. Yep. And what'd you say? Yes. That's the bad thing about it. You understand? Yes. All right. So uh, Stokely Carmichael, what else did he do? Do you remember? He, he helped create, he helped the people create which uh, word that became a movie? Black Panther in Lowndes County, Alabama. Good job. Um, today, they're also going to learn about the Freedom Riders and sit-ins because Stokely Carmichael was a part of those things too early on in his political career. All right. Got to hustle, grind, grow. All right, man. Let's see what you learned. What's that sound? Good. Good. Say it louder. Taught. Good job. All right, who'd you learn about? I learned about Stokely Carmichael. All right. And um, he he joined an organization called CORE, correct? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Why? What did he see on TV? He saw white people. Wait, no. He saw black people. He saw... So black people went into a restaurant and... It was what? What was, What kind of restaurant was it? It was just called sit-in, like... The restaurant was not called sit-in. What they did was a sit-in. Well, they... Where, where'd they go? Say, tell me. What's a sit-in? A sit-in is like when black people, they sat on the chair... Uh, you're not explaining. You can't tell me? You're going to do push-ups? Black people go into what type of restaurant? Um, white. White. White only restaurant. All right. And what do they do? And they sat on the chair to wait to get food. And then, and then white people um, start doing food at them. And they start, and white people start um, knocking them off the stools. And then um, they get back up. And then they keep getting hit more. And then. Um, so what happened with Stokely? Stoke when did he saw this where? on TV and then he got he got really angry and then um he got picked for No, he got picked. I mean he 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 joined what? He joined core. He joined core. Now Rick, what does core stand for? 
Core stands for um Core stands for Congress of Ray Ray Social Equality. Good job, man. Uh where is where was Stokely born? Stokely born was, well, I mean He was born where? He was born in Trinidad. And what's that close to? No, it's controlled by Spain. What's it close to? It's close to South, South America. Good. All right. What'd you learn about? I learned about freedom rights and sit-ins and Jim Crow laws. All right. What are Jim Crow laws? Uh, Jim Crow laws. Laws of segregation? It was the laws of the 1800s and the 1900s. Of segregation? Of segregation. And what did that do? It made the white and black separated. Good. And what's the freedom rides? The fr- the freedom rides are whites and blacks. The white white where whites and blacks would take bus rides through the South in 1961 to to segregated by race terminals. These freedom riders tried to use segregated restrooms, lunch counters at bus stations in Alabama, South Carolina, and other southern. And what are sit-ins? Sit-ins are when the black people would sit in restaurants and wait to be What kind served. of restaurants? White-only restaurants. And what would happen? They would get pelted or thrown at with ketchup or food and be hit. But the white blacks would just get back up and sit down and wait. And what type of tactic or strategy was this called? I don't remember. Yes, you do. Non- Nonviolence. Yes, this is a nonviolent tactic. Cause who was being violent in this case? The white. Right, because they were doing what? Being cruel. Doing what though? Hitting the black. People. Hitting and throwing. Right? Mm-hmm. Yep, mm-hmm. that's violent. Right? Right. All right. Good job. Good job, y'all. Hustle, grind, grow. <laughs>